What do you need? Um, where I see entrepreneurs go wrong is the way I went wrong. Um, they get together, it's usually three or four people, sometimes two or three people. They decide on a market need. They do a little bit of research. They figure out the competitors. They figure out what their product is going to be or what their service is going to be. And then they go out and begin to sell it. And uh, you see it especially in tech fields like software where they'll explain the software and how valuable it'll be. And the client will say, but I have this kind. And they'll say, yes, but they don't have this feature. And they get in these little feature wars and what about this service and so forth. And the entrepreneurs end up defending their product. They get a lot of rejection, so they get scripts going to defend their product. It, the Mr. Stoner moment for me was a moment of saying, what if I don't do defense anymore? What if I just open myself up and say, OK, well, what do you need? And from then on, my whole business career, what I've done is lead with that question. I start when I go in to see somebody. I don't pitch anything. I don't say anything about myself. I say, explain to me what's going on. Give me a, give me a view of what are the issues here. And there's almost nobody who won't, who won't answer that question. Mr. Hess is, uh, Professor Hess is clearly a, an expert at deploying uh, that question. Um, and you get people talking, and then you ask them, well, what's hard, what's difficult? And you find the product that's responsive to the core of what's difficult uh, for them. 